video i hope everybody is doing fine today is just gonna be a very quick video because i like to answer you all questions you guys been asking me lots of questions concerning business and i just want to come here and give you a quick explanation a quick answer a quick demonstration i know i did lots of videos concerning packaging how i pack my orders and stuff like that but you guys still ask me questions and somebody even called me the other day and I had a long conversation with them about packaging and a whole lot of stuff and guys it's no big deal I love to share information so I'm just going to give you a quick rundown of packaging again and since I'm packaging some stuff right now I have some orders and I'm just going to show you what I am doing today because packaging doesn't have to be difficult or very crazy because remember when you package something in extravagant packages they cost money and the client is just going to throw it in the garbage but you don't want to pack it with things that are so expensive that you're not making profit if you look at amazon which is the biggest shipping company of products you know what i mean this like amazon is like the number one guy there on the market and they don't really have any special packaging or anything you just put your stuff in a box and they send it to you but us small business we want to make things fancy we put little cards little notes have you ever gotten a note you know amazon thing saying thank you for shopping with amazon or thank you for shopping with whoever company no you don't because i mean they're a multi-million company you know what i mean and they have a whole lot of clients right but we are making products that are home based you know we want the, our customers to have an experience so I like to give my customer experience by giving them a sample giving them a nice card inside of my box but it doesn't have to be super super expensive you can make your own cards or you can buy cards that are very reasonable price like you can go to the dollar store and you can go in the wedding section and you can buy pretty pretty cards and they just customize them to whatever color or whatever brand colors that your business have and that's what I do. I have like gold and so I went and I bought gold cards and I customized them to fit my my um, business brand. And I've made my own cards. I've used stickers. Being, I have been creative in making stuff. And you can do the same thing. I want a customer open the box like, oh, it's so nice. You know what I'm saying? If that's what you want. But guys, please don't go overboard because you're here to make money in the business that you're going to run. So don't go crazy with it. So i'll just show you some very simple things like you guys ask for what i do so i have this order here and it's just for soap for one soap right and the soap so i already have the soap in here it's just wrapped like this very simple because we're organic and we don't like want to be wasting packaging and stuff so the soap is packed like this because it's one soap and we have bubble wrap inside there and as you can see the sample is in there the invoice is going to go in next and then i have this little thank you and it's gold because my company brand color is gold and then here i just write a note behind for the customer saying hello put the hello whatever the customer name is and then i send my name in the bottom i just say thank you for shopping with us you know little things you know and this is very cute somebody opened it like oh it's a thank such a cute thank you note okay so that and then you just put your stuff in there and you just seal it up and i put my company um logo on it so when they get it they're like oh this is my stuff from mexican classic so they know you know it's from you when you get it. you don't have to do that but i like to do that when the postman can be like oh this package is from mexican classic so i like to do that I'm going to show you the cards that I buy. The cards come in this fancy box. And this is what the cards they look like. And again, I pick cards that have my gold, col my colors. It looks like this and it just say thanks. So when I have a large order with lots of soap, see, it, it's plain inside. You can customize it. I've put lines, I've put stickers, I've put whatever. This one is so pretty on the outside, I don't need to customize it. I paid, I think, like a dollar for, I think, a hundred or something like that. Okay? In the wedding section. You can go to any wedding store, whatever. They have lots of cards. 
and don't go to a fancy store because if you go to a fancy store it's going to be expensive all right so i'm just telling you guys so you can go to the dollar store and purchase some of these things but you have to go in the wedding section and you can find some other moms and pop stores that sell stationery and you can get this for maybe five bucks you know and i think it's 50 for five bucks or 50 for four dollars in some of those stationery stores and you can customize them like i said i like to buy them plain with nothing written inside and i can customize them the way i want it now in this box here i have a super large order i have a 12 14 soaps in here order and then i have shea butter but this one has a card Oops. already inside of it and i just put this cute little um flower with a B at the top just to close the back this is very cute somebody like oh there's a bee a little sticky thing back just holding that down instead of just like you know sticking it out and then i just put the person i just i put the person's i put the person name behind there in front and it goes in the box and i'm gonna put some bubble wrap at the top and that's basically it the bubble wrap is just to prevent the things from moving too much because we have so much soap in this box shea butter they ordered all the soaps are let me open the box here so you can see let me take the card out because we have so many soaps and the soaps are all wrapped just like that right they're not in any plastic because we're trying to be as eco-friendly as we can we tend to wrap them in this tissue paper which is very very inexpensive tissue paper like this and we put them inside the box and i'm going to put this at the top and then envelope at the top and the box closes like this i have to put some have some filler that i'm going to put at the top just to prevent the soap from moving around in the box so this is just a very simple and easy way to pack your stuff and make it look very presentable once i close the box i want to just show you how the labels are on, on the box it's not anything special i just put the label on top of the box that's it and the box is ready to go these trays are trays that i i use to keep my pen to write with i like to use ballpoint pens and i just use my string that i'm going to tie the soap with of course i have a scissors and then my soaps which i'm going to process next are right here okay so they're by order so when i have like two persons just two soaps i put like this and one like that if i have more than three then i have all these soaps here with the person's invoice in the middle all right but if i just have like this is three different orders then they can stay on the same tray and i'll just put one in one put the invoice on top and that's very easy and this prevents you from making mistake and i already did that in, in a video to show you guys but <laughs> i guess people just want explanation so i'm just going to give you what you want and so that's basically it and so that's it this is how you package the soap and this is how i store my already printed soaps labels in here all of them have a compartment and have a couple of these it's very easy and very organized so for those of you who asked me questions i hope this question uh was satisfactory to you and then you see how i pack my orders very simple no fuss but it's very aesthetically pleasing and people are very happy when they receive the order with a little thank you card inside of it saying thank you to a customer it shows that you know appreciation it shows that the customer is thinking about you it shows like it it become kind of personal you know the customer say oh my goodness the the owner take the time to write a handwritten note to me it makes it, it makes the person feel special so that's how you can kind of customize your things and make it a little bit more special than somebody else and this is exactly how I pack my boxes. And I already have a video where I show you how I, I do my um, my bags. You know what I mean? But if you guys want to do the video again, I can do it again <laughs> for you all. How I do my bags, my like local delivery bags. I can do another video for you guys. But guys, please go back and watch the other videos so you can see 
all those videos that I did.